Welcome to the channel. I'm Stacy, and my goal here is to help you to play better and sound better in your worship services. Today I'm going to be highlighting the Fender Black Panel amps found in the HX World. The Princeton Reverb, the Deluxe Reverb, and the US Double Vibe set up like a Super Reverb. The Princeton Reverb is a low wattage amp and sounds best super cranked, and that's how I have it set up here today. The Deluxe Reverb is a studio go-to and it has great full tone, has great overdrive. So I have it set at just beyond the edge of breakup and that gives us a good sparkly bass tone that cleans up pretty easily with your volume pot on your guitar. And then uh, my Super Reverb is based on uh, an amp I own and I use the US Double Vibe which is based on a Twin Reverb and the main difference between that and a Super Reverb is the Twin has two 12 inch speakers and the Super Reverb has four 10 inch speakers and 10 inch speakers do break up at a lower volume. And so you're gonna get a little bit more of a growl tone out of the Super Reverb than you would out of a Twin. Uh, just like the Vox amps, as I was setting these up, I listened to a lot of sound samples and expert tips on how to get the best out of the real deal, put those things to the test, and I found some great tones on these three amps. All right, let's hear how they sound. So I'll be using my full pedal board with the compressor and overdrive section going into the front end of the amp. The compressor and Euphoria will always be on. And then I'll kick on one of the other two overdrives, uh, just depending on what I'm playing, uh, to get the tone I'm looking for. So the HX Stomp's gonna be set up with a noise gate at the front end uh, at minus 65 decibels with 120 millisecond delay on that, going into uh, modulation, and then it splits into both amps. I've got one set clean, one set a bit more overdriven, and then that goes into a tremolo, and then that goes into the loop, which is running the Jet Eternity and the Jet Revelation, covering all my ambient effects, and then capping that preset off with a simple EQ bumping that holy mid-range.
To me, they feel quite a bit different than the Vox amps, but they definitely have their place in the mix. What are your thoughts on the Black Panel amps? Let us know in the comments. If you found this video helpful, subscribe and hit that like button for good measure. Also, there's a handful of downloads free for you in the description box below. I hope you have a great week and I'll see you in the next one.